Let's talk Koji. He is a very aggressive character with insane offstage potential. His signatures are among the best in the game, good for both throwing out raw and following up light attacks with. Sword Side Sig will be a great example of that. It's got incredible force, it's powerful and neutral, and it's good for following up light attacks with. Wuxiang has a late whiff punish on my neutral light. It gives me time to dash out of the way and respond with a side sig to pick up the kill. Chase dodge after a side light or neutral light when the opponent's at low damage can lead into a follow-up side signature. Here we actually see Wuxiang attempt to dash backwards, causing the first attack to whiff, the second hit connects, and we even ledge guard his recovery. And lastly, we're going to look at when it's good to charge this on whiff. Here we see Azoth get into position to try and punish the whiffed sig, but because I held it, we're able to bait him. Sword and sig has an incredible hitbox, also hitting both grounded and aerial opponents. It's also got respectable force for what it is. After forcing Diana off stage in this clip, we use an NSIG to cover that aerial space. She not only dodges, but also attempts to jump away. Much like neutral light, Koji's NSIG can follow up a side light. In this clip, you even see Jiro try and jump out of the string. Because it has good force and sends the opponent upwards, can be good to gravity cancel. Here our down air sets Quora up. I believe Sword Down Sig is Koji's weakest signature. However, it does have its uses as it covers a great deal of space quickly. In this example, I'm simply not in range to get a more optimal punish, so I down Sig Queen Nye. Here I land a side light on a deep red scarlet. Because of the spacing and damage, I don't think I can side sigger, so I chase dodge to down sig. Against Wu Shang, he's far too damaged to get any kind of follow up after my side air, so I chase dodge into down sig. This leads us to bow side sig. This move is really good for getting kills, can close the gap quickly, or follow up light attacks. Against Orion, we're going to side light chase dodge into side sig. You can actually see in slow mo he gets a side light out, but we're able to beat his attack. If the opponent dodges in towards you after the side light, you can backdash into side sig. And the reason you backdash is because that cancels a lot of the forward momentum Koji has. Side sig is also good for following up aerial attacks. Here we see a side air into the immediate sig. Bow neutral sig can kill very early, although it won't hit grounded opponents and requires a bit of a read to pull off. We saw how to punish with side sig after side light on a grounded opponent. If they dodge into the air, you're going to be able to use neutral sig to punish. Against Ember, we're going to see kind of a hectic clip, though this ground pound puts her right in space for the end sig. We even slightly walk over to follow the dodge. The final example is going to be a gravity cancel. There's nothing too special here, but notice how easy it is to kill off the top with this move. Bow down sig will be your option to hit stacked. It has pretty weak force, but in exchange for that, high utility. This first clip against Yumiko is going to be pretty standard. We see that she tries to go through me to the weapon, probably anticipating a side light, but down sig covers the space. Here against Jiro, he uses a lot of options. He burns his air dodge there, and then uses all of his jumps, letting me get the down signature for free. Here's after he's dodged, you can see he has no jumps left, and that's a very easy down sig, and we're able to get the follow up down air. Against Isaiah, we land a side light chase dodge down signature. Because he does not immediately dodge after that side light, we get that for free. And we follow up with the down air to ledge guard and secure the stock. That is going to bring us to the end of the Koji guide. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. 
follow the channel if you want some more content like this. Feel free to ask me any questions down in the comments and I'll get back to you.